Uh, glad to have you with us this morning. We uh, prepare our hearts for worship as we uh, listen to the prayer. Shepherd Lutheran Church, Peterborough, New Hampshire. I'm Pastor David Mueller, and we welcome you for our worship this morning. Today we celebrate the eighth Sunday after Pentecost, and our focus will be on the epistle reading from Ephesians chapter 1, uh, which is a long doxology. So we will begin our uh, first hymn this morning, 800, 819, which is basically the whole hymn is a doxology. Sing praise to God, the highest good.
sin we deceive ourselves, and the truth is not in us. But if we confess our sins, God, who is faithful and just, will forgive our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Let us then confess our sins to God our Father. Most merciful God, we confess that we are by nature sinful and unclean. We have sinned against you in thought, word, and deed, by what we have done and by what we have left undone. We have not left you with our whole heart. We have not left our neighbors as ourselves. We justly deserve your presence and eternal punishment. For the sake of your Son, Jesus Christ, have mercy on us. Forgive us, renew us, and lead us so that we may delight in your will and walk in your ways to the glory of your holy name. Amen. Almighty God in his mercy has given his Son to die for you and for his sake forgives you all your sins. As a called and ordained servant of Christ and by his authority, I therefore forgive you all your sins in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our intro for this day, a portion of Psalm 143. For your name's sake, O Lord, preserve my life. In your righteousness, bring my soul out of trouble. Hear my prayer, O Lord, give ear to my pleas for mercy. In your faithfulness, answer me. In your righteousness. Enter not into judgment with your servant, for no one living is righteous before you. Let me hear in the morning of your steadfast love. For in you I trust. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. For your name's sake, O Lord, preserve my life. In your righteousness, bring my soul out of trouble. We sing the Kyrie, page 152. Be in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the peace from above and for our salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the peace of the whole world, for the well-being of the Church of God, and for the unity of all, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this holy house and for all who offer here their worship and praise, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help, save, comfort, and defend us, gracious Lord. Amen. Sing the glory next Chelsea's page 154. Glory to God in the highest and peace to his people on earth. Lord God, heavenly King, Almighty God and Father, we worship. Oh uh -huh. 
the Lord be with you. And also with you. Let us pray. O Lord, you granted your prophets strength to resist the temptations of the devil and courage to proclaim repentance. Give us pure hearts and minds to follow your Son faithfully, even into suffering and death. Through the same Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen.